What's good YouTube, it's your boy Ethan. I'm back with another reaction video guys and today I got a recommendation sent in by Lou so thank you so much for leaving the comments down below guys. I really really do appreciate it all of y'all you know with the recommendations and suggestions so thank you all so so much. Today we got Akala, I think that's how you say his name, Akala, his fire in the booth. This is part one. Lou told me to check out this one. I noticed he has so many. I think there's like four parts, which is, that's a lot, bro. Damn near, you know, people usually only come on here maybe one, two times. So if I see my man come on here about four times, he must be crazy. You already know, fire in the booth, got the homie Charlie Sloth. So, you know, it's always funny to see him. You know what I mean? He's he's the hype man, bro. He, he's just, woof. Anytime someone say anything, that, that little switch he be spinning, bro, he love that button. But this one here, it, you know, hey, 5.5 milli? It's quite a bit, it's like quite old. Let me let me just, you know what I mean, point that out. It's a little bit old, so, hey, man, bear with me here. Uh, it's going to be my first time ever listening to my man on the channel here, so I'm excited to get into it, bro. You know, I ain't trying to waste too much of y'all time, so... Hey, I'm ready. Hope y'all ready. Before we jump into it, man, make sure I head down, smash that like button, comment down below, guys, whatever y'all want me to react to. Thank you all so much again, like I said previously, for the love and support. Thank you all, man, so, so much. If y'all new around here, make sure you click that subscribe button. Check out the Twitch in the description, guys. But let's jump into my man here. Akala. Akala. I kind of like that name. Kan Kalan. No, okay, but let's get it fire in the booth part number one man. Let's go. I Know you gonna dig this Oh, yeah. Perfect. Yo. oh Yo. this is Yo. This is some old stuff. Let me tell y'all Right just right off the rip. I can already tell Okay, yo Yo, I like you you're like a tiger. Yes, I grew up on a door in a single parent family. Been through a little bit of tragedy. Mm. Yes, I was around drugs and violence before the day that I started secondary. That's part of it, not half of it. Get the picture, the rest ain't necessary. Growing up, got a little caught up. That ain't even half of my life. Also, given Jeez. the knowledge of self, that is all we actually need to survive. If you saw me, age nine, reading Malcolm, just fine. Teachers still treated me stupid. Students that couldn't speak English, they put me in groups with. The irony is, some of the first man to give me schooling, you were called gangsters. I already explained that we know what the truth is. They used to say, don't be like me Yeah, I got a name and don't on the street Night time comes, I can't sleep It's the part that rappers don't speak We don't hit the road cause we're thugs Don't come out the room, wanna sell drugs If we got Damn, bro Whoa, whoa I mean, in this with some educational stuff Off the beat like this Talking about how we grew up You know what I mean? Poor poverty You say, yo, it's not like we come out the womb and we want to, you know what I mean, be on the street selling dope and doing all this. Bro, that ain't, that ain't life, bro. That ain't what we want to be, man. It's just, unfortunately, the certain situations, man, that's what they got us in. Hey, off the rip. It's the part that rappers Pray. don't speak We don't hit the road cause we're thugs Don't come out the room, wanna sell drugs mm. If we got the right guidance and love Would we fight people just like us? How can I knock the hustle to get man. by? How do you think I ate as a child? Judge no one, done many things wrong Just don't boast about it in songs But listen to my older bars I was just as confused as you probably are But you grow when you learn Travel one cut One too many man, you know, get caught up One too many man that could have been doctors End up spending the whole life boxed up You learn Damn. if you study So set out just to make them money No cover It's all about getting poor people to fight with one another So it's not you that us killing our brothers, dissing our mothers is right in line with the dominant philosophy of our time. But time is a cycle, not a line. Comes back around, you regain your mind. You be ready for the energy I challenge in my rhyme. Remedy the pedigree, the jeopardy your mind when the world is left is a crime. We can all fight with a bunch of bro. What? Hey man, we, we let a hey, woo. We only a minute 30. My man preaching so much. He said, Yo, we got some. Very smart, knowledgeable people, man. But, you know, they could have been lawyers, doctors, whatever the case, bro. But they, they stuck in this box, bro. And we ain't getting no help. Well, the only thing they're telling us they want to go to school, y'all got to pay for it all. Bro, we can't even pay for, you know what I mean? Food and essentials. Twisted, bro. It's crazy. 
Others over crumbs, harder to fight the one who makes guns. We can all talk, get two dollars. Harder mm. to be the one who seeks knowledge. If we understood economics with no money's nothing, think nothing of it. Money is a means to get wealth. Not the wealth itself and don't get Awful. confused far from oh. broke. All that you see me do, I own, but I won't hang what I make about my neck. I know from where that the diamonds came, but I do literally own a library that definitely costs more than your chain. And businesses and property far from starving. I eat quite properly and I don't care. Just said it for the kid. Come on, that's smart, bro. He said, I'm trying to get property, library. You know what I mean? Buildings, homes, stuff like that that's going to keep me wealthy. And it costs more than your chain, bro. But what's, what are you going to do with that? Smart. Hey, smart. Kids, you need to know you're not broke to listen. Don't know an asset from a liability. They've never been shown nor told the difference. So they don't change ah. situation. Which is mine in Britain is Asian. That's significant. Not coincidence. Asian people build businesses, not by flossing, mm. going out shopping, giving out the culture for everyone's profit. Who runs Bollywood? Indian people. Who runs our fish? So we shake our ass and dance as if racism just upped and vanished. But has it? No, it's right on course. You're beating so bad, you're trained to ignore. Let me not just make. Come on, bro. And you know it's crazy. This joint came out 2011, bro. They're still so... It like, bro, it's been 10 years. There's still so much racism in the world, bro. Obviously, it was still happening back in the day. But I mean, like... Bro, he was preaching that then. And it's still happening. Oh, man, it's crazy. Sweeping statements. Give me a second. I'll explain it. For small amounts of drug possession, there's more black people in jail in America. The net is for rape and armed robbery and murder all put together. You can say they're just locking up tugs. Imagine they're in prison every middle class kid that had ever held drugs. Damn. Oh, that's right. That'd be your kids. Bigger than that. What is going on with this prison in America's private business? They get paid 50k mm. per year per inmate by the state. Just wait. Also legally are allowed to use their prison inmates as slaves. Cheap slave labor. Big corporations. They come out of jail when they can't get a job. So when we celebrate going to jail we are literally celebrating enslavement add to that that the hood that you live in engineered social condition the breeds mm. crime by design where do you think you get your man you could say that they're just black but i like to deal with facts in the 1920s you would have found in america black towns prospering centers of economics to education to make you proud but some people couldn't bear that the former slaves would not just lie down to the kkk and other hate groups Burn those towns to the ground, killing hundreds mm. if it ain't understood. You think you were always living in the hood? It's only been 60 years since the hung blacks and burn them, and that was so cool. They were your baskets, picnic baskets, even gave kids the day off school. Go see a lynch. Bro, hey, protect my man at all costs, bro. Let, let me tell y'all that right off the rip. Protect my man here. Y'all hear what this man's saying? He's educating so many people. Bro, this shit is still happening. It still is to this day. Unbelievable. But yo, we gotta protect my man, bro. Preaching crazy. Have a picnic. It's fun to watch the little monkeys die. And people act a little dysfunctional. You wanna pretend that you don't know why? If your color means you can be killed and you're powerless to get justice about it, is it difficult to figure out how you would then end up feeling about it? And that ain't excuses. Mm. Just dealing with the roots of abuses that make a reality. Where a generation of young men speak of ourselves as dirt casually. That's America. This Britain. Something similar, some different. In this country, the first enslaved were the working class. What's changed? Worse jobs, worse conditions. Damn. Look where you live and yet you go to the pub. Friday Day night you will fight with a guy don't know what for won't fight with a guy shoot in a tight who send your kids to die in a war they don't send the kids to the rich of the politician it's your kids the poor british are the same to go and die in a foreign land for these wars that you don't understand yeah they say you are british and that lovely patriotism they feed you but in reality you have more in common with immigrants than with your leaders i know both sides of my family black and white are fed ghetto mentality reality in the system poor people are dirt regardless of shade but with that said let's not pretend that everything is the same when our grandparents came here to britain if you had a criminal record you couldn't get that ain't protected mm. for all of the stupid, stupid abuses they will be living. Kicked in the teeth, stabbed in the streets, many times firebombed our houses, put feces through our letterbox, and of course the cops did so much about it. Daily, up to the 80s, people spitting in my palm because I was a goofy baby. But of course, that has had no effect on why today we are crazy. And none of this was for any good reason. They were just dark and grieving to ease the guilt now for all of this treatment, constant stereotypes and needed. So if I celebrate how big the money no, that I'm flipping, clips that I'm sticking, chicks that I'm hitting, I'm playing my position. But if I teach a kid to be a mathematician, messing with the schism, how they gonna fill a prison when materialism is not Oh my goodness, bro. Hey, I'm trying I'm not trying to pause too much because my man's talking about some this is real life, bro. It, it is still happening to this day. 
So they don't, hey, they don't want us to teach them what the right and wrong is, bro. For real. They, what, it's only what they put out there is, that's it, bro. That's what they need to know only. Oh, man. This guy is... He heat, bro. I'm playing my position, but if I teach a kid to be a mathematician, messing with the schism, how they gonna fill a prison when materialism is no longer our religion? What do you think we got now in Britain? Just like America, private prison, prison for profit. Yeah. That mean when your kids go jail, people make money off it, so keep environments that breed crime, build more jails at the same time, market badness to the kids in the rhymes. Long as rich kids ain't dying, it's fine. Get them to the point where some are so lost. They actually believe if they don't celebrate killing themselves off, that it's because they're soft. Bro, that's insane. And you know what's crazy is a lot of people don't even know that, bro. Like, these prisons are privately built. And, this, you know what I mean? They's making money off of putting more inmates in. Like he's saying, bro. Each inmate, you know, 50 Gs or whatever. <sighs> Add that up, bro. As billies. It's wild, man. But people don't know, and then, you know, all they want you to do is get caught up in all that stuff, man. And if, this guy is unbelievable. He, he's talented, bro. He's educated. If, was Malcolm soft? Was Marley soft? Tell me, was Marcus Garvey soft? Well, was Muhammad Ali soft? Nah, nah. I think not, but they want us to think that the role is cool. Being on board is all we could do. We don't mm. control the whole cell production, so who benefits from us moving the food? Or thinking there's no way out of old life, but Malcolm X used to hustle on the roadside. And Marcus Garvey organized more than six million people with no Facebook or Twitter. Why is it something you can't eat? Ish. One of my own homeboys did a 10 straight in the boxing yard. Now Damn. what's he doing? Passing his doctorate. Don't tell me that it's too hard. Who trained you to believe you're inferior? Song Bo Everdo in Nigeria are the... That's what's up, bro. We say you can always change, man. Even if you, you know, you do it wrong, you know what I mean? You go do your thing in, in the slammer, come out, bro. Like he said, look at this homie. He's worked hard and he's a doctor now. But you can do it. They just want you in that box, bro. They don't want a lot of us to succeed, man. But you can do it. Just like my man saying here. Malcolm X did it. Preaching. No social media. Said he got six million people behind him, bro. You, hey, you can do it, man. You can the do remains it. of an ancient moat dug 1,000 years ago. 20 meters wide, 70 down. Round the remains of an ancient town. There's 400 square miles around. 400 square miles around. Please, please don't believe me. It was a documentary on BBC, but we ain't studying history. Too busy watching MTV. And MTV Damn. said, wear platinum. Now everybody want to go and wear platinum. And MTV said, pop magnums. Now everybody want to go and pop magnum. If MTV said, drink prune juice, you will start hearing that in tune soon. Hey, today you're warm, car Is it now more important what I've got to say? Oh, when I drive a Mercedes, by the way, so everybody listen to what I got to say. <laughs> Does that make you all happy? Ah, oh, but she, if my head's still nappy, think to myself, hey, she's so mad at me. But on the mic, not one batters me. All of this here's good for the rhymes. Put us in the same place at the same time, and it's clear to everybody I'm out of my mind. Some of these guys are running out of the rhymes. Clear to everybody, those has got ears. I'm the guy that they just might fear that they want to get near, but they can't have a peer all day. I'm hard looking, you just like beer. Front on the kids for another five years. Come to my shows and some criteria mean that much to them. It's a movement. I don't speak for myself, but a unit. Black, white, man, woman, anyone who Respect truth we put in. Dudes are like no dinner, we're just putting. Yeah, you're sweet, but no substance pudding. Mm. You can never ever be with a level on. All songs get played out, never living. We speak for the people. Bro, this guy's so good. He's so talented. This is the type of. Bro. This is the type of thing people need to be listening to, educate themselves on, man. Because he's trying to tell y'all, don't always listen to the media and the TV, bro. They tell you to, you know, he's saying, oh, where, where this, where this, where this. Then everybody start doing it. You got to think on your own, bro. You can't always be driven by social media and, you know what I mean? Whoop. <sighs> Shit, bro, this guy's clean. 
tumbly Not for the old fat guys in offices And the girls love him Ain't fair He can't even be bothered to comb his hair Anyway, that's enough kissing my own ass. Back to the more important task of being so shower I got half the hood screaming Knowledge is power And I ain't saying that'll change rap back But I do know this for a fact Right now there's a you on your block With his hands on his hood Space screwed up So he don't care, don't give up That he won't let nobody call his bluff But the words go in Open your shack covers Once that's happened There is no going back Or would you start to see What is really happening Who the enemy you should be attacking is So read, read Read, stuck on the block, read, read, sitting in the box, read, read, don't let them say what you can achieve. Because when people yep. are enslaved, one of the first things they do is stop them reading. Because it is well understood that intelligent people will take their freedom. Because mm -hmm. if we knew our power, we would understand we can't be held down if we knew our power. We would not elevate not one of these clowns if we knew our power. We would not be arrogant when we get two pennies if we knew our power. We would see what everybody sees that we're rich already. But never mind, MCs go run for your mummy. I'm hungry, I run for my tummy. That's enough. Back to worshiping money. I'm off. Bro, he's so smart. He said, y'all got to keep reading, reading, reading. Keep educating yourself. Get smarter. Knowledge is power, bro. He said, what what they do when they took them into slaves, man? They took away their reading. Took away their knowledge. And made them only believe what they trying to... Woo! Hey. Back to the study. Man! Charlie Sloan, baby. Yo, that was wild. That guy is... He's unbelievable, man. The, the stuff he's preaching and saying... I hope a lot of people... Hey, I mean 5.5 .5 million listen, so... I hope more, even more people, man, because he's talking some extreme stuff bro some real stuff and people really gotta gotta yo follow it you can learn so much by what he's saying man and he's doing great protect my man and yo I, I don't know man like he, he just got me like speechless it's wild but hey that's going to be the end of the reaction, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you head down, smash that like button, comment down below, whatever y'all want me to react to next. I'm always in the comments looking for great recommendations by you guys. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if y'all know around here. Check out Twitch in the description down below. I'll catch you guys in the next video, man. I'm out. Peace.